All right, guys, welcome. Today, we're going to be going over some of my favorite Wendigo videos. In my opinion, these videos are some of the most compelling evidences we have for the Pale Hominid, also known as the Wendigo. Let's check out the first video. I know he'll believe me. I can believe this. I got it on video now. People think I'm nuts. I got it's on video. It's playing right now. I, right. I I put the iPad in the window, and now this thing's coming up to the steps in the, my, my backyard, Mike. It's it, it's a, recording the video. Yeah, right now it's on the video. It's a play. Right right. Looking out. Yeah, on the right side, there's the weeds there going down that okay. sidewalk. Okay. I got it on. I got it on everything, and you're oh. and everything. Our, I meet mean, the whole thing right now. It's the iPad's recording everything. Me, you, and this thing. And I'm a. I don't know. I should. <laughs> what's the police gonna think? It's looking. Oh my god! Oh my god! Dude, this thing is weird. Something that skeptics always point out when it comes to cryptids is that, oh, well, why didn't they just call the police or why didn't they get help? The reality is, is if you call a police officer and tell them that there is a pale white demon in your backyard, um, they're probably not going to think there actually is a pale white demon. They're going to think it's either A, just some person that's a home intruder, or they're going to think you're on drugs. They might use that as reasonable cause to investigate your house and arrest you it's unfortunate but these things do happen this is part of why so many bigfoot encounters go unreported as well so keep that in mind i think it's very interesting that we got that little bit of audio um overall guys this piece of footage in my opinion is incredibly convincing um i cannot say whether or not it's a hoax or not i can tell you this video is 100 percent very freaky and it is consistent with many other reports of wendigos that we have so It's stuff like this in videos that make me pay attention. If this guy was interested in just making a scary video, he didn't need to call his friend and have his buddy pray. I don't know, man. And, and as always, you can always say, oh, well, he added that so that it's, you know, it's easier to believe. It's like, okay, sure, whatever. Maybe, right? I'm not saying this video is legit. We don't know 100%. But man, there's some things here that make it feel very authentic. I want you guys to take note also of the size of this creature. Wendigos, as far as I can tell, aren't actually that big. They're probably anywhere between five and six feet tall. Oh my gosh. Look at it move. Ah, rah, I hate this thing, dude. I'd shoot this thing immediately. If this thing was in my backyard, I would shoot this thing freaking immediately. Holy crap. How terrible. So anyway, guys, I love this video. It's a great video. Um, yeah, look, uh, look at the tree line twice next time you're camping. This next video is an older one, but man, is it a goodie. I bet many of you have already seen this one. In my opinion, this is, again, a very compelling and convincing video for the existence of the Pale Hominid. Okay, I've been hearing some noises on my roof tonight. Hear that? Hear that? Yesterday I heard the same thing. But I didn't want to come out. The camera wasn't charged. I can hear something up there. Hear that? Hear that?
Hello? Oh my god! This video speaks for itself. It's very clear that someone or something was standing on this guy's roof. He went to go grab a 22, which I have a feeling that might be the wrong choice for something like this. Anyway, guys, another one very, very convincing. Now, could this be a person? Again, absolutely. However, I don't know, man. Again, there's just something about it, something about the way it moves. It's consistent with the last one to go that we saw. So. Keep that in mind, guys. There's a profile that's being made here. They move in a very twitchy, kind of unhuman-like way. They look a lot like people, but they're uniform in color. They are completely pale. Um, it's just terrifying, the things that could be out there. This next video, in my opinion, is probably the most convincing. It just feels the most authentic and genuine. And you'll see what I mean. Hey, guys. Uh, I just wanted to show you guys my cool base that I made a while ago with my cousin. It's really nice. See, we got the entrance all fenced off. Got this thing, I don't know what it is. Oh. Well, that stinks. But yeah, we got some chairs. What was that? Is that a cow? What is that? Oh, freak! <laughs> Again, the video speaks for itself. What we're seeing is a consistent profile of what a Wendigo at least moves like and what it looks like. We're seeing the same thing throughout all three of the videos. A uniform white grayish color a strange, almost human way of moving. And here's the freakiest part. They're completely silent. Of the three videos we saw, they didn't make a single freaking sound. It doesn't mean they can't make sound. It just means that it looks like when they are pursuing something, they are as quiet about it as humanly possible. Um, that is something to consider again when you are off in the wilderness on your own little armed expeditions. So what do you guys think of these videos? I think these videos are all incredibly convincing. I am not claiming that they are all real or real sightings of Wendigos, but I think they're definitely contending for very convincing pieces of media for an unknown pale hominid creature that exists out in the woods. Later on, I'll do a more thorough video talking about the origins of Wendigos. Where do they come from? Are they just human beings that have crawled out of hollow earth? Are they cannibalistic demons? Are they something in between? <laughs> that is something I will get into in a future video. That's going to be all for me, guys. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful rest of your day. Again, leave a comment. Am I crazy? Are these videos convincing evidence of, of the Wendigo or am I just losing my mind? Maybe one day I'll get one on camera. <laughs> That'll be a very interesting video. Take it easy. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye-bye.